Rue Pont, it's, it's a huge garden. It's a, it's, a, it's a sonic cathedral, and that's why I'm so thrilled that we're playing it here in the Armory. The configuration of Rue Pont is that we have a fairly large ensemble sitting in the center, and it's being surrounded by six soloists and plenty loudspeakers that are all basically embracing the, the entire sonic instrument. Repent is about the antiphony, about the dialogue of all these sources inspiring each other, sending out a signal that will be modified by someone else or rejected or transformed or enhanced. The instrumental ensemble in the middle is something like a prism. If someone just basically shoots a sonic arrow into the ensemble, that goes somewhere else. And um, that's why it's so really beautifully crafted. This is a perfect example where we can almost see the sound traveling. With Repon, we decided to play it twice so that people can or have to change their location to experience a different listening angle. If you're sitting next to the, the soloist who plays the glockenspiel, you will have a very strong impression of that, which is kind of defining your listening perspective. So naturally you want to sit on another side so you can you know, hear the other instruments better. But every seat is equally perfect because you're really sitting inside that cathedral of sound where everything is like whirling around and spinning and it, it really takes you and it, it lifts you up to, to some wealth. It's about the subtlety of perspective and listening to this incredibly richly resonating instrument, which is Le Pont. We hear or see in an artwork what we have experienced and what we want to experience. So we're becoming like an, a resonance, an echo chamber of what we're being confronted with. And that's what we listen for. There is no such thing as a qualified listener. We're all equally qualified, the people with a lot of experience and the people with zero experience. We all hear something about ourselves. And uh, this is Repon.